In today's video, I'm going to be opening these seven packages from six different Poshmark sellers. None of these people know that I'm doing a video opening up their package. And the idea of this video is just to see how different people package their sales. This idea started a few years ago when I made my first Poshmark sale and I got the email that says, package your items nicely and include a personal thank you note. And that email made me wonder how nicely do people package their Poshmark sales? How detailed are these thank you notes? And that's where this video idea began. So let's get started. The items on this side, so these three items are all from sellers who have less than 100 items in their Poshmark store, indicating they're probably selling just out of their Poshmark or out of their personal closet. And then these items, these two, this person has 120 items in their Poshmark store. This one has over a thousand. And this one is actually from partner, Poshmark's partnership with DJ Khaled. They had a pop-up celebrity closet for him. So that means this sale was actually packaged by Poshmark employees. So we can see if Poshmark's words line up with their actions and if it is packaged nicely with a personal thank you note included. Okay, let's get started. So should we, we'll start with this one. This person had 73 items in their Poshmark store. So a relatively small closet. And she used a Tyvek mailing envelope. You can get these for free from the USPS website. I have a video where I do a little walkthrough of how to order free packaging. If you wanna see that, I will link it below. All right, let's get to it. She has printed off the label and taped it on with packing tape. <clears throat> So it looks like we've got some tissue paper. Okay, so she has um, put a piece of tissue paper around it and wrapped up the dress. Yay! <laughs> One of the reasons I had to get this video done is we are going to Spain this week and I ordered a couple maternity items and so I'm at the point where I'm needing some maternity clothes, so this dress is one of the items I got. Anyways, so she used Tyvek envelope, one sheet of tissue paper, and no thank you note. As with all these videos, I never share my personal opinion um, about what I prefer or don't prefer. I just want to show you guys what people do and leave my opinion out of it. <clears throat> all right, this next item. This person had 40 items in their Poshmark closet. So again, somebody who's probably just listing items from their own closet. They have used, actually I haven't seen this priority mailer before, so I don't know the name of it off the top of my head. But it is a padded mailer, but it's larger than the padded flat rate envelopes that I'm used to. And they have this, <laughs> their label is massive. It's like um, the full page long. All right, let's open it up and see how they package inside. <clears throat> okay, I see some more tissue paper. All right, she has wrapped the item in tissue paper. This is the other maternity item. So here we go, she has it very nicely folded. And no thank you note on this one. This is just a maternity dress. So again, that was actually the exact same. The first two had pretty much the same type of packaging and they had one sheet of tissue paper inside. Feel free to put your comments on um, what your preferences are for packaging so other people can see. From previous videos, it's pretty split in terms of people who put nothing in their packages, people who put lots of things like thank you notes or a free gift, and people who, like these sellers, just put a tissue paper. The answers are all across the board. Next up, this item is from the closet that had the least listings. This person had 28 listings in their Poshmark closet and she has sent it in a legal flat rate priority envelope. This one did start to open, although to be fair, this, these um, items have been sitting here for up, up to a year. This um, one from DJ Khaled's store is a year old. So some of these items have been sitting quite a long time. This one's from October. So November, December, January, February, March, April. So six months. So in that time, this did come up. I don't remember if that was up when I got the package. Okay, let's open it up again. She sent it in a 
legal flat rate envelope. Nothing inside. And we have the item that I ordered. I will say overall, as long as the item I ordered is in the exact condition that um, it's, it was described as, I'm very happy buyer. So these are a pair of pants for my husband. They look great. They look exactly as expected. So that that's awesome. So what was that in summary? Okay, so it was, yeah, it was just the envelope with the item in it. <clears throat> All right, we have three items to go. These next two items I bought about a month ago. Poshmark had a free shipping hour. I think they had a couple free shipping hours where if you bought anything over $10, you had got free shipping. Since then, they have changed it to discounted shipping, unfortunately. But the one of the days that they had the free shipping hour, I bought four items. So I bought that yellow maternity dress, the blue maternity dress, and I bought these two dresses. These two are for me to actually flip to, so I will actually just list them in my bridesmaid dress store, but I thought I would include them so that you can see the packaging. So this person had 120 listings in their closet and she has um, unique poly mailers. So you can buy these on a bunch of different websites. Unlike the USPS packaging materials that the, the sellers have used so far or the priority mail boxes, those are all free. So unlike those that are free, you do have to buy the poly mailers that have unique designs on them. So hers, it says thank you on it and it has pink and white stripes. And let's open it up. So because of the free shipping day, these dresses were both exactly $10 or was that what, maybe it was even slightly less than that because I bought two from her. But here is the item and she just has included the item with nothing else in it. So just the item in the poly mailer. So, so far we have zero for four for thank you notes. Here is the other item from that seller. And I'm assuming it's gonna be packaged exactly the same, but let's see. Yes, it is packaged the same. Just the item and the poly mailer. All right, we have two items to go. These two, this one is from a seller that has 1,200 items in their Poshmark closet, so a bigger seller. And then this one is from the Poshmark DJ Khaled collaboration. So this is sent from Poshmark themselves. All right, so let's start with this one. Again, this seller had 1,200 items in their closet and they have these packaging bags that say, thank you, your purchase made my day. And I hope this package brightens yours. So these are, I'm assuming this person had to buy these packages. I've never seen these before. So I'm assuming they're unique to that seller or something I mean you can buy online. All right. Feels heavier than normal, that's why I'm checking. Okay. So again, no thank you note. And we have the item inside this clear packaging. So I do see these more often with bigger sellers because they have inventory systems and they might have the items saved in their inventory system in this packaging. And my item is folded, folded nicely inside the packaging. Looks good. Okay, and final item. Again, this is from, so Poshmark will partner with celebrities and I, I think the celebrity gives them the items to list and I'm not sure how the deal works in terms of where the money goes. Poshmark partnered with D DJ Khaled over a year ago and that is the first item that I purchased for this video. So let's see how Poshmark actually packages up their items. I bought a pair of jeans from the sale. I uh, don't know if I actually wear them because they're now going to be too small for me because I'm pregnant and I don't know when I'll fit this size again, but I did buy an item so that we could see how Poshmark packages up their sales. I guess first of all, I should say it came in a 
priority mail box. I think this is the medium flat rate box. Yes, it is the medium flat rate box. I use this box a lot for shoes. Again, you can get this for free from USPS just by ordering them on their website, or you can get them from the post office. But if you're making a lot of sales, my post office anyways got really annoyed with me asking for packages. So that's how I learned you can order them online. All right, here we go. <laughs> so that's unique. They actually have something specific to DJ Khaled in the box. All right, it says, you the best. I appreciate you. Interesting. It says, hi, Amber. Thank you for showing some fan love by shopping my closet and supporting the We The Best Foundation. Okay, so that's where the money's going. It's going to his foundation. Be a star in your new looks by showing off your hashtag posh style. Don't forget to tag me, DJ Khaled, and at Poshmark. Bless up. DJ Khaled. So that is the letter included. So they did definitely include a thank you note. I don't think this is a real signature. It looks printed. The name looks like a real, like someone actually wrote my name in. Then they have one sheet of tissue paper. So consistent with the first couple of sellers. So one sheet of tissue paper and the item that I purchased folded nicely in the package all right so they use usps priority mail box one sheet of tissue paper and then they had the thank you card sitting on top so i hope that was helpful for you guys if you are nervous about how you're packaging or just wondering how other people package so again comment down below any of your thoughts if you want to see more package comparison videos as i said this is a series that i have done on my channel so i have many other videos like this I will link one right here. I will also um, include a link to the playlist in the description and in a pinned comment down below. Thank you guys all for watching. Stay tuned because as always, I'll have a new video out soon.